Hi everyone, I'm back with another video and today I have a card share for you, a Christmas card share. And these cards are from kits that I showed in my last haul. Um, I bought two kits. One was a uh, Bow Bunny Christmas collage and it made eight cards. And then the other card kit I bought was uh, Merry and Bright from Echo Park. So these are not my designs, they're just from a kit, but I thought I would share the cards with you and maybe you could be inspired to make some Christmas cards. So the first uh, eight cards I'm going to show you are from the Bow Bunny Christmas Collage set. So um, I really liked how she did her cards. Um, they're simple but they're elegant and um, I like the, I don't normally like Bow Bunny but I like the way she used the paper in this um, set of cards. So this is the first card. Um, I added some sequins and then the, the the twine and um, this little vellum piece here came with the kit and, and everything else and it looks really cute. Um, normally I don't think of flowers when I think of Christmas cards but I really liked how she did this card. I inked the edges of the flowers and I inked all the papers with vintage photo and I liked how she printed the vellum on the printed uh, Stamp, either stamped or printed um, sentiments on the vellum. I thought that was a really nice touch. And this one is, um, you, you took part of a paper bag and you cut it down to be flush with the edge of the paper. And then just added a bunch of different banners and pieces from the paper. I loved how she used feathers in the cards. And uh, I normally don't think of feathers when I think of Christmas. But um, I really liked how these turned out. I thought that was really cute and I liked the use of the burlap too that she used. This one, um, we layered a couple of different paper bags. A vellum and a, and a paper bag and a tag. And then layered a bunch of papers, added the sequins and the, the little um, twine and then the feathers again and a flower in the background. And this is all one piece of paper in the background. And this one too used feathers and more sequins layered. I liked that idea and then the vellum and the lace and um, some more sequins along the side. I like how she, we cut them flush with the um, paper after we stapled them on. Which I thought was kind of a nice idea. Oops, some of those. Um, this one we used one of those 3 by 4 cards that came with the paper and popped it up and added some staples to it and then layered um, vellum and then some uh, cardstock punched out and then some pattern paper with the lace and for the background it's one solid piece and this one used another uh, glassing bag I don't know where she got this film strip from but it's got Christmas um, images on it I think maybe it came with the bow bunny line and then more vellum and more feathers and sequins. So that was the uh, Bow Bunny Christmas collage and the next set of cards um, are from the Merry and Bright by Echo Park. I really like this paper line. It's really bright and fun looking. Here it's just a doily um, underneath a scallop and then the sentiment punched on a circle and popped up and then some vellum and paper pattern paper behind it. So simple but really cute. Uh, this one, she took the 3 by 4 card and we cut around the banner of it. And um, this is just vellum with washi tape on it. And then it's layered on some pattern, two different pieces of pattern paper and then some more um, cardstock that's punched. And then added the, the sequins again. I really like this one. This is a great way to use up your scraps. So it's just the black for the tree trunk and then some different pattern papers and you kind of stagger them a bit. I inked all the edges and added the sequin, sweet sequin and the um, little piece of twine at the, top, at the top. This one I really liked. Um, we used the 3x4 card and popped it up and added some banners and some sequins and put it on the back of some, on the background, put uh, 
some cardstock that is cut in half. It looks like it's one big piece. It's actually two strips of cardstock with the metallic on the back. This was a simple card, but really cute and effective. Just cut out the banner piece. It was one 3x4 card, and then we cut out the banner that was in the 3x4. And then added the little banners and the vellum again. And some twine at the top. Just cute. Another 3x4 card cut down. A flare button, some banners, and then vellum in the background. This one, um, it was a sequin pocket, added some banners, and then some little black enamel dots with some pattern paper and cardstock in the back. And this one, um, we had to cut out trees out of rectangles using our paper cutter, which is quite easy to do. You just have to line up the paper cutter and cut it at an angle from the bottom corner to the center of the top of the rectangle, and then do the same thing on the other side and just make your rectangles different sizes. Then added some brads and sequins to the top and a piece of vellum along the bottom. And so those are my Christmas cards. I hope it inspired you. I loved doing those in the kits. It, I didn't have to think. And um, like I said, these were not my design. I bought them from kits. So hopefully you get inspired. Thanks everyone for watching. Have an awesome day and bye for now.